What's up guys, I would like to introduce something new and very cool to the channel, Small Cap Sunday. Here I will discuss every Sunday a new or a small low micro cap altcoin. And the, you know, the point is because we can stay safe in crypto, that should be your number one priority at all times. But you of course also sometimes want to make maybe a DGM bet that can actually 100x. And therefore we are going to take a look at this. So welcome to the FOMO Factory. Subscribe to the channel turn on the bell notification and smack that like button if you're interested in this kind of content now i would like to give you the disclaimer though that although these projects are relatively of course higher risk than uh, the projects like CDFI, Bitcoin, Volker Forge, whatever that I usually talk about, I do a good bunch of research before I talk about such a project. If I have any feeling that it's not safe whatsoever, I won't talk about it. None of this is promoted and all of that. So I would like to give you that disclaimer as well, right? Now that you know that, I think it's pretty cool. And if you do not like the higher risk, uh, higher returns uh, projects, just skip the Sunday videos. I get that it's not for everybody, but I sometimes like to degen in some stuff because even in this current market where Bitcoin is still sitting around $28,000 or so, it is definitely possible to make some money with altcoins. Overall, I am saying that altcoins will get wrecked, but it doesn't mean that there are no altcoins uh, that can do 10, 50, 100x in the meantime. That happens all the single time. And that's what we gonna look for on Sunday. So the first project that I would like to introduce goes in this category, category because it has both what I'm looking for, low cap and new. Um, why do I say that? This is Love Hate Yunu. Love Hate Yunu is a project that I have seen a couple of times already and at first I wasn't that interested because I thought like ah, it's another you know another meme coin whatever it's not interesting these things always fail but then I saw it so many times that I felt like, okay, maybe I should actually research this project a little bit. And the more I looked into it, the more I started to like it. So I did some deep diving because sometimes you see a project say like, yo, we already raised like $3 million in this case. And that actually is done then not true. And you get wrecked. In this case, it is true. I've bought into the pre-sale. I followed the address. It went to the uh, router where it got... Uh, what do you call cross chain and they uh, put it all into stables and they actually have three million dollars sitting on chain raised by the pre-sale so far so that's very 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 good to see because a project needs to have runway to survive right if a project in the pre-sale just raises like 10k or something like that yeah then how are you going to manage the project in the first place right um so Please, if you ever look for these kind of projects, I will talk a lot about uh, how to do your research on this uh, channel, but that's one of the things that I am looking at, for example. Right, so Love Hate Juno is a meme coin. It is a meme coin though with utility, and that's also what I like. And it's a meme coin with a community. And that's probably most important, right? Because a meme coin without a big community is not a meme coin at all. Now, this has hype. This is really, this gives me really Doge vibes on a smaller scale though. But you know, that's where Doge started as well. I'm not saying this is the next Doge. I mean, Doge is Doge. But Love Hate Genu, I don't know. I got a pretty good feeling about it. So I'm gonna leave a um, link in the description down below. Definitely go check it out if you already feel you're like oh i i just believe you let me buy <laughs> first check out the video of course if you want to buy you can connect your wallet right here on the front page um, and then you can choose to buy it with bnb usdt or ethereum it's on the ethereum chain but it's possible for you to buy it with bnb therefore they do the routers the swaps and the cross chains it's easy to purchase and that's what i like as well that they have thought about that so i personally degent with a couple of hundreds of dollars into this project because i really feel like okay quite interesting quite interesting so let me show you a little bit about what they do what the tokenomics are um, about the team 
about their transparency in their AMAs as well. I really like it. If you go to the website, you can find the white paper right here. I'm not going to read it to you all, but you can see exactly what it's doing, how to stake it, why you need the token, what's on the roadmap, but we can mostly find it on the website already as well. What I really like though, they have an audit by solid proof, so not one of the worst uh, auditors out there, and they completely passed as well. Um, so it's it when it comes to that the contract is flawless it's perfect right there's nothing wrong with the uh, with the contract according to solid proof and solid proof is one that I have a lot of faith in um, it doesn't make it risk-free though don't get me wrong uh, there are a lot of projects audited um, that didn't work out right but it's better to see it like this then everything is red so a lot of green green boxes checking all all the way right so that, that's what i like so what is it it's basically a voting platform why do i like that well a lot of projects they talk about governance and how um, the community can vote on stuff right and that's important because who else is so involved in a project than their own community so a community community has to have a saying the problem is a lot of platform or a lot of projects they use things like telegram or mostly twitter for people to vote problem with that is is that you can just buy telegram votes um so it's not a fair way of voting so if someone feels like now this is what it has to be and he feels like let me throw 50 dollars at it so that this is what the project is going to do because i want yeah that, then 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 the whole voting system is already broken right so in that case i really like that lafay Genu is a meme coin token that offers real utility in a voting system based on the blockchain technology this is a secure and transparent platform for voting on issues that matter so vote to, uh, what i also really like is you need this token in order to vote you need to stake this token so you can use the platform and if you use the platform to vote you also earn tokens by staking tokens, users can participate in the latest pools I've taken up <laughs> and earn tokens for voting. Over time, the community will decide on which pools they want to create. So I think this is a pre it's not a groundbreaking utility, but it's actually a utility that we need, though. So I really like that. And like I said, what, what a meme coin really needs is community community power 90 percent of the supply that will be sold on the pre-sale to ensure that the community holds the majority of the tokens and the rest of the 10 percent is reserved for liquidity listing fees and community rewards so it's basically all going to the pre-sale in that case i feel like okay i'm interested in the pre-sale a lot buying it on the open market right after the pre-sale not so much because that's probably where a lot of people will dump their tokens because there's also no vest period you get all your tokens at once so either buy the pre-sale or wait until pretty far after the pre-sale until the selling has cooled off right otherwise you will be the exit liquidity of the people that participate in pre-sale let me can i actually make a heart with this i'm stuck at that so <clears throat> <laughs> so this is how these kind of things kind of look like they have a dashboard that they are working on this is how it's going to look like so you can see the votes right here you can create pools you can see the popular pools the rewards that you get for actually voting and your balance as well so I like it. So they have a roadmap. They are now working on, well, the pre-sale. It's the stage where it's in pre-sale right now. Exchange listings is coming. In quarter three, they will do a lot more uh, by actually launching the staking utility. The dashboard is coming and the first rewards will be distributed. Quarter four, uh, you will be able to create custom pools. They will do more stuff with partnerships, sponsored pools, branding, uh, rewarding mechanisms. And later in quarter one, and that's what I find most interesting, is where um, other projects can actually integrate this system into their project right so that's when i feel like okay that's where the real utility comes in um so definitely go check that out now that twitter a lot of hype already Thirty-three thousand followers for a meme coin that's in a pre-sale that's actually not bad right i'm not comparing this to the high cap projects the good projects the projects that's already out there do a lot and and all that kind of stuff i'm comparing it to its own niche and when it comes to that 
it's doing very good it's doing very good and it's all not fake as well they have quite some interaction as well so that's what i like and they just revealed on binance live so the ceo is actually out there doing amas on binance live um that's quite of a huge thing so therefore i feel like yes it is a new project that's high risk yes it's a meme coin that's high risk it's in pre-sale stage that's high risk but they got so many different things that i feel like okay but you make it lower risk with that and higher reward with that as well if you go into the telegram um, you can see that a lot of people in this group are freaking hyped about it right that there's a lot of talking going on in here 15k people in here and it's very active so it actually gives me that meme coin vibe as well that a lot of new meme coin projects are actually missing this one is doing that they got a little bit more information about the tokenomics and the stages we we are currently in stage five of the pre-sale are you asking me is it too late definitely not too late as long as we are in the pre-sale it's not too late and token um sorry stage eight the token price will be a lot higher already so that's with these things usually the earlier you are the better you are off as well now um if you if you look at this you search for market cap um and you will find that the, 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 the market cap, I thought it was here somewhere. Yeah, the fully diluted market cap will be $14.5 million. All right, so all the tokens that exist, everything together, it will be $14 million. So I said, why is it so high? That's low, <laughs> fully diluted, right? So it's not in circulation, right? It's fully diluted. So we'll never, you know, be more tokens than that. Right now, I am not going to compare this to Dogecoin. Well, I am. But I don't want to say that it's actually... Uh, what the fuck am I doing? Coin get go. <laughs> I'm not saying this is the new Dogecoin because it isn't. But I just want to make a comparison, right? Dogecoin has a market cap of $11 billion. It does show the potential what mean coins have, right? $14 million. If you want to do it 10x, it's sitting at one, uh, $140 million, right? $140 million. That's a lot of scrolling before you get there. Page three, probably, or something like that, right? That will put it at rank somewhere 200, give or take. With a meme coin with such a... Uh, utility community hype early stages all of that i think there is potential in this one is this a 100x coin could be in the bull run but could this uh do at least way better than the pre-sale i i i think so i definitely think so um plus that you know when it releases it is sitting at a uh, 14 million dollar market cap but like you see on the website as well or what you saw at the stages we are now in an earlier stage right so this current price that you pay for it doesn't equal 40 million this equals a maybe a 10 million dollar market cap or so so i am quite interested in this i have copied or i have uh did a couple of buys multiple wallets i want to have it all over the place um staying a little safe have it liquid as well because if there's low liquidity for some reason i can sell it all so i decided to do it like that so i'm interested in this if you like small cap sunday let me know Again, a lot of people don't like the high-risk stuff. Totally fine. I totally get that. And if you really feel like, yo, you must not talk about this kind of stuff, also just let me know. Let me let me know. I will do it democratically. It's just an idea that's popping up into uh, in my head. Um, but it's all about you, community. I want to make you happy with the things that I talk about. There's enough to talk about experimenting here but i thought it was a pretty cool idea if you like it like the video subscribe to the channel in specific if you like this project there's a link down below where you can check it out or enter the pre-sale if you have any questions feel free to ask me and i'll see you guys very soon